Hi everybody, I'm Jim at ifoundjim.com and my channel on YouTube is I Found Jim. I have this really cool little $250 Acer Aspire V5 which I bought off of eBay for $250 and it actually came with the Windows 7 Home Edition and I decided that I wanted to upgrade to the Windows 7 Professional. So I went on to eBay and I bought Windows 7 Professional I paid $109 for this and it was a sealed uh, case and everything. Uh, it had the cellophane on it. It looked like it was factory sealed. Of course, when I opened up this after I took the cellophane off of that, it had this uh, label on there, which broke, which was, you know, looked like it was genuine. Turns out it was a pirated edition, or actually loaded onto a computer three times already before I got it, so it was actually no good. And what would happen when I loaded it on there, at the very bottom right-hand side of the screen, of course, the screensaver, there was none anymore because it went black, but it would say this right here. As I go to this other screen, it said Windows 7 build 7601 this copy of windows is not genuine and so then i went on to uh, youtube and i tried to figure out how to fix that and there was some override stuff if you actually went into uh con or my computer and i right click there and i go to properties it would bring up this window of course and then it would tell you the properties about uh, windows 7 professional at the very bottom it says windows activation well what actually happened is that when i had this um windows 7 professional running after about 10 days, it would bring up an activation uh, box, and it would say, activate your product. Well, I activated it when I bought it, and I thought it was activated when I bought it. Well, what it does is a, a, a pirated edition or an old edition lets you activate it to load it onto it, but it actually only gives you 30 days to run it down here unless it's activated. So what I did is I actually went on to YouTube, and I figured out how to override it, but the actually the best way to do it is to take this right here, and you have this, you have this, and you, what you end up, what I ended up doing, um, is I went on to, uh, I found Microsoft's 800 number, and I basically searched it, and they came up with 800-numbers.net, and here's the United States Support Center for Microsoft, and if you can read that, it's 1-800-426-9400, and I called up Microsoft, and I got their tech support, for Windows 7 and I told them that I had bought this copy of Windows 7 on eBay and it was brand new and factory sealed or at least it looked like it was when I broke that tag up on top and I loaded it on there but every time I after 10 days or every after about 10 days every day it would bring up that window to saying you have to activate it so I tried to activate it by putting the product uh, key in there which is right here for this uh, actual product and it wouldn't let me do it. So then I decided I better call Microsoft Tech Support, and I did. I called Microsoft Tech Support right there at that number, 1-800-426-9400. And I actually talked to somebody and told them that, yes, I did buy this on eBay. It was factory sealed. And they said that the only real way to get a real good copy of Microsoft uh, went to, uh, 7 Professional is you have to buy it through as a store or make sure that it's not a pirated edition, which this actually was. But they actually overrode... Uh, the activation key code, so they let me activate this pirated or old copy of Windows 7 on my computer, and it actually is activated, which is very cool. So if I go to my computer, right-click, and I go Properties, they actually activated it. They said right there. They I, I sat right there while I was on the phone, and we activated this product, which was old. I had to listen to a little spiel about maybe buying some extra software for $149, which I declined. And they said, and I asked them, would this Windows 7 Professional be good for the life of this machine? And they said, absolutely. So that's how you actually override this Windows 7 build 7601. This copy of Windows is not genuine on your computer. You can actually call Microsoft and tell them your problem, and they will activate your product so it's very cool instead of doing a bunch of other stuff which youtube tells you that you can do you can override your uh windows 7 for 30 days extra but it only gives you 30 more days so this is the actual best way to do it is basically call microsoft's tech support at 1-800-426-9400 and they will actually override and activate your bad edition of Windows 7 Professional one time, forever, for the life of your computer. Guaranteed.